Hey guys, it's me Chris from The Sunday Job. I was going to make a video and show something we found. It's not that uncommon in old houses, so. But uh, I had to patch some drywall. And this is the piece we took out. And I noticed that when I was cutting it, uh, this old bit of wall, 3 8 drywall, it has calcium and paint on it. And some of you guys may know what calcium and paint is. It was a real chalky paint used, like, you know, kind of common in the 30s, 40s, um, as a quick way to, to paint walls and, and get them, you know, kind of presentable. Um, the bad thing is, no paint will stick to it. Now this has a bunch of coats of paint on it over the years and you know you can kind of get it to stick but it, it just it wants to peel off unbelievably and I was going to show you guys that. So I've already started peeling it off here but let me get you it was commonly like a green color sometimes pink sometimes other colors yellow but it leaves a residue on your fingers and it's chalky and the paint just won't, will not stick it just peels right off so a lot of times in older houses you just get you know this calcium and paint and it's a real problem it's just a real chalky you know you can see the brush strokes in it um, somewhat so it's just a real Real chalky paint. I think Benjamin Moore makes a, a calcium and recoder now, and maybe some other companies do, but um, that can be a problem if you run into that in older places, painting and stuff. And a lot of reasons that's why in older homes the, the wall, the, the paint just is peeling off like crazy. First of all, it's probably oil based paint, which is hard and brittle. And secondly, it might have been over the calcium and, and with time and temperature changes and that kind of thing, it just releases and, and uh, it starts just peeling off like crazy. So it's just a little bit of a, something we found here, you know, and, and it's not uncommon in older houses. This place is probably built in the 30s or, you know, around, around the 30s. So yeah, just something to be aware of when you're working on older homes. Have a great day.